Do you want to take better photos and videos on your iPhone? Of course you do. You live off those likes. So you understand how difficult it is to get those perfect angles or stable videos. Well, Autoclip, the makers of the 4-in-1 lens, also has a case that may help with collecting all those likes. Let's take a look. The studio case has a hard plastic back shell that consists of a matte texture. The interior has a glossy pattern finish and there's a stiff rubber edge around the whole case. To install, simply go volume side first, then snap the opposite corners in place. The buttons are covered but in a thinner rubber allowing for clicky feedback. The same goes for the volume buttons, a fair size cutout for the mute rocker, cutouts through at the bottom although the lightning port is pretty wide, the audio cutout is a tight fit, and of course a larger than usual camera cutout to accommodate their line of Olaclip lenses. As a case, it does feel solid in the hand. The matte texture on the back as well as the sides are comfortable to hold. It's not extra bulky so I don't feel like I'm struggling to hold more. The rubber edges actually help with my grip, both one and two handed, so it's not sliding around in my hand, but it's smooth enough to slide in and out of pockets with ease. The real magic is in the rail mounting system on the back that allows you to attach their included accessories onto. The first being two standard cold shoe mounts, then two quarter 20 mounts for tripods or grips in both landscape as well as a vertical position, and my favorite piece, a finger grip for both landscape and vertical shooting as well. To install, each piece has a hook on one end and another that wraps around the edge of the case. The railing has a larger opening at the top you slot into first after hooking it onto the case's edge. Then simply slide it into whatever position you feel comfortable with. Although everything is made of plastic, it's surprisingly strong and doesn't come off without you wanting it to. Do note though, the rail only works on the two sides and not the top and bottom portion. But the beauty of the system is this. You can attach all the accessories on and be ready for a full shoot or simply slide whatever you don't need off and you have a running gun solution for a lighter shoot. My go-to setup is this. The Olaclip Active Lens which includes a wide and telephoto option, a small LED video light, and a Rode Video Micro along with a mic adapter to use on an iPhone. The case allows you to have everything in one place and most importantly the hand grip offers you confidence when shooting. Running around with this gear can be cumbersome but knowing it's securely held in place alleviates the fear of dropping anything, especially your iPhone, so you can really focus on getting the shot. The system can be used one handed and puts your hand in a comfortable position to stabilize your shots. The wide angle helps capture more of your subject and the Rode video mic helps isolate the sound and remove any wind noise. And the grip helps stabilize vertical shooting too, whether it be for Snapchat, Instagram or Facebook live videos. As a comparison, the left side is with the case, hand grip and wide lens and on the right is just the iPhone in a case. The shot is much smoother with less shaking and jagged movements, which again comes with the confidence the hand grip provides while you hold your iPhone. But of course when you're not out shooting, the case is still a case in the end. The hard plastic shell along with the raised lip around the screen help with tabletop protection as well as light drops, which is similar to what we found in the review of the original auto case. The only problem I had is the lack of storage options. My solution is to keep them attached onto the kit so I can have it ready when I need it, but the case actually comes with a kickstand as well for viewing content, but I already lost that in some dark corner. And lastly, just using a hand grip is a viable option for extra confidence in taking videos and photos, but even without any other accessories, it can stick out quite a bit. So it may limit you in how you store your iPhone, which if you wear tight jeans is going to be a hassle. The case and clip-on accessories retail for $80 and is only available in black. Links to the case as well as the setup I use here which includes the light, the mic adapter, the Rode mic as well as the all clip lens can be found below as well as to the right of my head. If you're serious about mobile photography or videography, the $80 is definitely worth the investment in how easy it makes with shooting with the iPhone now. The studio case offers options for all types of shooters whether it's vertical for snapchat or landscape for those cinematic shots. And of course the module rail system allows you to ditch the bulk when you don't need it. That's it. If you love what you see and want to support me in creating more reviews, head over to our Patreon and enter our monthly giveaway. Don't forget to like and subscribe below if you want to see more and leave a comment letting me know what case you want me to review next. I rest my case.